guys welcome back to episode seven so we got um a little bit of stuff planned hopefully by the end of the ep episode we'll be able to start moving our books and stuff in to the new library so this is a lot bigger library than we had um it's mostly done it just has some roofing parts to be uh put on and then when we do get to the um development of the second floor We'll have direct access right in the middle, so it'll be pretty easy to do. Um, I'm still contemplating how I'm going to be doing the upper floor. I need to think a little bit more on that, but um, for the most part, uh, it's just a few extra wooden blocks and then we'll be good to go. Uh, the other thing that I was thinking about after I was editing yesterday, I was looking at the size of the barley field, and I don't think that's going to be large enough for us. Uh, we do sell a lot of barley, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just, um, like these parts right here still need to be mined out because they're not, um, the right type of soil type. It's, um, limestone and dirt, and we need dirt in order to grow things on, so we still need to mine those, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of expand it out to about here. And that should give us plenty of space for um, growing our barley. So I'm just going to try to outline this a little bit more. I don't want to get too close to the um, part down here because it's um, we're going to be using that. F we'll have to fill that all in. Quite a bit of it in, actually. So, uh, yeah, it's going to take a little while to do that. So... I think that should be good for the size though and once we get this part filled in then we'll be able to um start growing the barley there we should have extra barley it takes longer to grow um but it's requires a low skill level to actually plant so it's pretty good um i told them to start planting trees as well um probably won't need it got quite a bit of wood still but you never know when we might need it, right? So, it looks like these are used armor or something. I'm not sure what's up with that. Might have to check out our logistics for our um, things here. So it's, uh, let's see here. Good to flawless. 75% quality. What is it actually containing though?
Alright guys, so I got a couple of our people scheduled for building because I noticed that everyone was gardening and that wasn't really helping with um, actually progressing, so um, I made sure that there was a few cooks and that there was a few gardeners, uh, well not gardeners, um, builders, so we have at least some dedication going on now, though I think everyone's back to the normal what do you call it? Schedules, pretty much. Um, there's a couple people that can garden now. They're, they reached, um, what was it, level 25? Yeah, it's uh, this guy, which is... Actually got the Night Owl... Um, what do you call it? The perk? So, he operates better during the night. And I have him scheduled for the night. Though, I think our herbs are pretty much finished now, so... But our cabbage needs harvesting, so people are probably going to be doing that now. And... I'm not sure how much we're getting from all that. Eight cabbage, that's not too bad. Not sure where all the cabbage <laughs> seeds do go, though. Okay, they're, they are ending up on the other side, that's good. I was wondering if it was ending up in the water because that would be bad, but it seems like they'll be put on to somewhere nearby. Now I'm not sure how that's going to affect the um, parts around here, honestly, because that's on the edge there, but um, you know what, we might want to consider having them not plant on these edges just because if we start expanding it it won't have anywhere to go and it's probably a good idea to have a little bit of um parts around here that it can the seeds and stuff can go or it'll probably go in the water uh this part should be fine i don't think there would be any concern for this. It could probably go over here. But just to be safe, what I'll do is I'll um, take those top three off. And as far as this, um, just kind of remove the edge. I'll have to manually harvest this, that's fine, but uh, better than losing our product or our seeds, like for our produce and stuff. There we go. Alright, so that should be good. It's still quite a bit of area where we can actually farm and stuff, so it should be.
Great, so it's gonna take a while in order to get um, all the cooking stuff back on track. We got um, some stuff over here that needs to be tended to, like the livestock, which is gonna take a lot of um, time to do because I think we create like, what is it, like 25 per thing? We're like a couple hundred under. So yeah, that's gonna take a while. And then we have the regular cooking on top of it, which we have absolutely no food left. So yeah, we need to uh, make that up, I think. But you know, it, they'll do what they need to do. We'll tell them to um, just pause the other stuff for now. And hopefully we can get those two things, those two tasks done just so everything's like caught up and stuff like that. And then once we get that part done, we can start enabling that. We're good for the um, fruit juice. And as far as the uh, meat, I'm not sure what, where we're restoring the meat, but maybe we have somewhere down here where we're restoring it. No clue. Said there was meat, so I'm not sure where it is. Um, oh yeah, there was that merchant that came in. That's right. Uh, do these guys sell? I don't know if he sells any um stuff. Do we have anyone local around here? Where are you? You're way over there. I don't know if we'll get there in time, but no, he's already leaving. All right, whatever. That could be why I couldn't see if they had any stone bricks. <laughs> That's alright. There's always more merchants and we'll be trading soon too, right? So, just uh, cut down these new saplings. Those are doing good. Um, yeah, so we started harvesting our herbs as well. And our cabbage is mostly harvested. Though we have some spots that still need it. And I started telling them to build on these outside parts. Uh, which will act as our foundation for the upper floor. And I'll be building the walls a little bit out uh, one block. And they'll probably put windows in there. That'll be a solid block there. And we'll do that for all the sides. Uh, something that we kind of did, I'm not sure if we did it. Alright, so there's a special guest over in our um, church here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to um, get them to 
provide us with a service. Um, we'll go ahead. Actually, we'll go with um, the aged fine wine instead. <clears throat> we don't have any bread or anything like that, unfortunately. Uh, we haven't been able to craft some of that up. We might want to store some in stock just in case, but um, we'll accept that. And then these guys will get a boost for um, basically uh, having the service and stuff. Now, I still haven't built the um, candles, so but the, the room's still good, so hopefully it will do fine. Yeah, so it's like a new thing that they ended up adding not too long ago. It's kind of like uh, they added bards, which are like musicians, and then there's a couple religious um, systems. One for the um, Oak Baron, and the other one for the Church of Restri Restitution, or whatever it's called. So yeah, outside of that, if you are new to my channel, we got quite a bit of stuff done today. I'm pretty impressed with the progress. Got everything moved into our new library, and we'll need to start putting down some more bookshelves because we're running a little bit low on spots, but it's, um, you know, we'll work on it slowly. But outside of that, uh, we got some stuff over here built. I started putting kind of like a walkway path in that will act as two things, uh, one for um, actually when the seeds and stuff go on the side, it won't, uh, spoil as fast. And the other thing it will do is kind of make it look like it's on a walkway type thing. So uh, I thought it would look really good for designing wise. And I'll plan to do it to the other ones as well. Just, um, might take a little bit longer to do. We have tons of wood, so it's not an issue. <laughs> so <laughs> need to figure out something to do with all the wood and stuff. But outside of that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below rate the video and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.